May 2023, I created a new PvP alt and headed with my holding alt straight to army in low sec with the goal of surviving solo against all odds while making some kills. After bugging the local reds for a while now, I thought, hey, let's have an NFG day. By the way, and for the record, NFG is the red alliance they are all in. Let's have a chill day with them. Today, it's NFG day. At the beginning, a question to you all. Isn't it just a shame that they try to shoot me after I tackled an orca for them? What do you think? Watch until the end and drop your thoughts in the comments below. I spotted an NFG Navy Corvette in space and at first I thought, let's take down that ship. But then the NFG guy reached out to me. He mentioned that he's got great at PvP and knows I've been hunting him. He admitted that my presence was hindering his mission. So since today is my NFG day, I offered him temporary blue standing for the weekend. He accepted the offer and successfully completed his mission. By the way, I'm the one surrounded by reds and he has about 10 people here as backup. Why does he fear me? Then I saw an orker at the belt. I quickly hopped into my little gomer to engage and hold it down. I knew I needed assistance because with my 16 day old character and a gomer that dishes out only 180 DPS, taking down an orca solo would be impossible for me. I warped in at a distance of 30 kilometers and successfully tackled the orca. I decided to give some intel to the NFG guys in local. Well, well, this moment would determine whether they were cool or if they would go against me. There's an unwritten rule in low sec that goes, don't shoot the tackler if they've caught something significant. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Mr. Young Guns warps in with a rapier. Long web always hurts. Okay, Young Guns, point at him. That's cool for now. But here's the deal. If you kill a target together with your enemies, first keep the distance and second don't trust them. Now a panther is coming in and a fast tackle and... Here we have a Loki. I mean, at this moment I can warp away, I will be on the kill anyway, but let's stay and see what they are doing. So here we go, Mr. Young Guns decides to target me. Hmm, shame on you, mister. And even Calvin joins in targeting me. You can see their true colors now. You give them a kill worth over 1 billion and they turn against you. Foxy seems to be a man with honor, he did not target me. No, here comes the webs from the rapier, so I need to go. I mean, they will not manage to catch me, but let's burn out. He lost web on me after 44 kilometers, and so I'm gone. Always remember, if you scare the local reds for weeks, they might hold grudges. In such situations, you can see the true character of some players. But hey, today is my NFG day. I helped one NFG guy complete his mission, and I tackled an orca for the other NFG players. One hour later, they are sitting at gate and camp it. I mean, I don't know how often they do this, but it's maybe the major activity of their corporation. I hopped in my gomer and decided to attack both noses at the gate. Playing a little bit cat and mouse with them is always funny like hell. Maybe only for me, but I love it to be honest. One reship to a stabber. 
For sure I asked him for a one versus one, means his well-skilled old tune in a stabber against my Germer, but who would be surprised, he did not accept my one versus one offer. Well, since today is my NFG day, I decided to inform the gate campers that I would warp down and let them kill me. I hopped into an empty Gnosis and warped directly to the gate at zero. Here's an important tip for all the new players. When you know you're about to die, align your ship to a nearby object like a belt. Keep your ship aligned at all times. Just before your ship is destroyed, spam the S button on your keyboard. Remember, spam it before your ship explodes, not after. This way, your pod will warp away safely. Well, for a long time, they don't know what to do. Shoot! Shoot me! I mean, they kill me now for the first time, and maybe they think it's a trap, but it's a free gift, guys. As expected, they decided to shoot me, just like good gay campers would. After that, I offered Mr. Yangans a second Gnosis as a free gift, and he accepted my trade. So here's the NFG day in an overview. I helped one NFG guy with his mission, tackled an orca for them, willingly let them kill me, and even traded a Gnosis to them. I mean, I've been annoying them for two weeks now, so it's only fair to have an NFG day once in a while. But here's my learning of the day. Don't trust the local rats, even if I tackle an orca for them. Isn't it just a shame that they still try to shoot me afterwards? What do you think? Drop your thoughts in the comments below.